It is time for Raccoon News. Oh, Rick. Raccoon News. Man, this is Raccoon News. Oh, yeah. I like that. Yeah, he loves that. And there's a lot of raccoon news to be discussed, Menace. All right. Let's start with something fun. This is uh, just a video of a man and his wife. They had a raccoon prowling around their house, and unfortunately, they didn't do the smart thing, which is feed it and let it into your home and uh, cuddle it. (laughs) Uh Befriend it. But they did the nice thing. If you are going to remove a raccoon, you want to put one of those live traps out there, you know, that catches them humanely. That way they could be taken off to the woods and released without, you know, breaking their leg or whatever. You yeah. Think. My grandma did that with her neighbor because her neighbor, legit, not lying, had 300 cats oh that would go into her yard. 300? So 300. Where were they all coming from? The, well, you, she just had them in her house. Kept accumulating. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, once you start feeding them, then they uh, uh, then they start banging and then one thing leads yeah. to another. And... So my uh, grandma would put a trap in her backyard <laughs> like that for... Like the raccoon trap. So that's then. that's what this is going on here. And this yeah. this big manly man, you have to let the you have to undo the trap to let the raccoon out. Sure. And that's mm-hmm. what he's doing here. Let's see how that goes. We caught ourselves raccoon. <laughs> <laughs> no way am I doing this. <laughs> you gotta let him out. It's okay. <laughs> Whoa. Uh. Go, go, go! <laughs> 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 Oh, oh my so god. Uh, that manly vagina. man is Ryan Shelley. Ryan yeah. Shelley. <laughs> <laughs> what a weird. You sure it's not Shelley Ryan? Get it! Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's funny. Oh, so that's, <laughs> that's like when Greg sees a butterfly. Uh-huh. Yeah, that's oh! right. Same sound. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Except butterflies don't hiss and they don't have teeth. <laughs> oh, uh-huh. they, they do. Oh, oh boy. Raccoon news! All right, I uh, missed a pre- uh, trigger warning, menace, as they say <gasps> to kids these days, oh, no. which actually makes things worse. But yep. uh, this next story out of ABC 6, Knoxville, will not be nice, menace. They found no. they found some dead raccoons. What? And it made the news because they found a lot of dead raccoons. <gasps> but there is a silver lining to this story, and that is okay. the name of the county where they found them and the name of the sheriff who is looking for more information. Turning now to a bizarre story out of Cock County after someone <laughs> called police with a complaint that led to a disturbing discovery of more than 10 dead raccoons. Under- now, what was that, uh, uh, Greg? What Which, county? The, the county? Yeah. yeah. I believe it was Cock County. Oh, Cock County. Yeah, okay. okay. All right. All right. Her bridge. The images showing what appeared to be raccoon carcasses on a paved area alongside trash. It's an area typically known as an illegal dumping site. The Cock County Sheriff's Office posting <laughs> these pictures on Facebook. Sheriff <laughs> CJ Ball saying that <laughs> it is not clear what killed the raccoon. Wait yes. a minute. The sheriff's name is C.J. Ball. The sheriff of Cock County is C.J. No way. Ball. Get out. That's too <laughs> good. Perfect. Thank that you. is not oh my God. messy with the teleprompter. <laughs> he changed his name when he got the job, right? <laughs> what county am I? Oh, well, uh, let's there, see. C.J. Balls, where am I moving? There was a uh, a country station. Mm-hmm. In fact, that was the name uh, that you would see uh, in the office. They would have a bumper sticker of a local radio station called Froggy. In yeah. uh, Scranton. The office, yeah. There's yeah. froggies um, everywhere, yeah. yeah. Yeah, so there were these froggy stations, literally, and there were a ton of them in Pennsylvania, but uh, all the people that were on these stations would have to have, like, frog amphibian name. frog. or carpet. Yeah, like swamp-type names, like, you know, it was like Larry Lilypad. Jesus and, Christ. You know, it was like, yeah, yeah, something, something like that, like, you know, Freddy, F- Freddy the Frog. That's one way to brand yourself. Yeah, whatever. And so maybe that's part of what's going on here. Like, it's Cox County. And the sheriff is <laughs> Cock County. Oh, C O C K E, Cock. Yeah. Cock, Cock County. And his name is CJ Ball, so she messed up. Well, because she's going into Ball. The next word started with an S. Uh, this is on a paved area alongside trash. It's an area typically known as an illegal dumping site. The Cock <laughs> County Sheriff's Office posting these pictures on Facebook. Sheriff CJ Ball saying that it is not ah. clear what killed the raccoons. Ball also saying that in addition to the raccoons, they found tires, trash, <laughs> And appliances oh, weak. at the dumping ground. Uh, Let there be balls. There was something in that dumping Raccoon ground. Raccoon news. That they ate. Oh. Oh, I should have stolen the sign. Remember, I told you there's a guy running for city council named Dick Ryder. Yeah. Yes. Oh, I should have stolen one of those. Oh, sheriff ball. Oh uh, well, okay, that's sad. Obviously, uh-huh. although. Hilarious, menace! I've got something. Sure. We, we've got what? we've had raccoon books over the yes. years. There's raccoon video games out mm-hmm. there. What about something menace will never play? A raccoon board game. What? I bought what? it. It's here for you in studio. Oh, it looks what's amazing. It, what's it called, menace? It's called Raccoon Tycoon. That's right. <laughs> it's Rules. A big old Get it, Greg? They, they rhymed coon and coon. <laughs> coon. Are you kidding? Whoa. I like he, it. 
Yeah, he looks all fancy too. Yeah, like, so it's a basically it's kind of a, a Monopoly style. I'll tell you what I found. Here's mm-hmm. the uh, intro pamphlet. Ooh, turn to the first page, man. This is gonna read us the summary of how to play Ooh, Raccoon okay. Tycoon. Uh, game is under gameplay, right? Yeah, yeah, right there. With it. All right. In in Raccoon Tycoon, players try to produce the most valuable communities in an ever changing marketplace. They use the commonalities to build towns or sell them at the best price to secure great profits. These profits little pieces <laughs> can be used to win <laughs> attractions for all improved railroads or buy buildings. That can be play, uh, that can give pa- uh, players sorry that can give <laughs> that can give players power ups or bonuses in production. <laughs> Owning the best towns and railroads. <laughs> this is uh, mega boring. <laughs> <laughs> Destinations uh, victory. Okay, thank you. Oh, Raccoon news. Man, now, Greg, Whatever that said, meant. <laughs> okay, this, this game does look like it sucks. Yeah, big it time. looks so terrible. But it's got a special sticker. It's got the seal of excellence look from at, the, the, the Dice board. Tower. Oh, wow. Uh, yeah, yeah. Looks, Tom Vassell called oh, it one of his wow. best 40 board games of all time. Dude, so really? cool. Yeah, it's and the seal of excellence. And you got to get, like, wheat and lumber and iron mm. and... It's kind of like Sims, but a board yeah. game. Ooh. Sheriff, CJ Balls. <laughs> Sheriff, CJ Balls. Yeah, Google this. Raccoon Tycoon. Yeah, it's expensive and it's boring. <laughs> yeah, it looks dumb. Dude. Pick it up for Christmas. Ballin'. Yeah. Cock could- County. <laughs> they could have made it way cute. <laughs> this, that reminded me of, uh, what was it, the Oscars a few years ago with Dick Poop? Was oh, a- that was oh yeah. Year. Dick yeah. Poop was a banger. Yeah. And, well, we did the Dick- remix. <laughs> the yeah. nominees are Dick, Dick Poop. Poop. <laughs> For achievement, for achievement in cinematography, in cinematography. The, nominees the nominees are Emmanuel Lubezki for Birdman, Birdman, Birdman. Robert, Robert Yeoman, Yeoman for the Grand Budapest Hotel, Hotel. Lukash Yal for Ida, Dick Poop for Mr. Turner, <laughs> Dick Poop, Cock County, Dick, 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 Dick Poop, Sheriff Dick Falls, Dick, Dick <laughs> yeah, our friend uh, Party Ben did that one for us. Yeah. Oh, speaking of movies, Menace, there was a new record set by uh, for a an Oscar nominee, Everything Everywhere All at Once. There was spoiler yeah. alert, a raccoon character in that. Ooh. They had an auction, and the the little kind of puppet that was Raccoonie, yeah, like Ratatouille, but Raccoonie. <laughs> It sold for ninety thousand yeah. dollars. Winning bidder, sure. CJ Balls. No, no, not CJ Balls. The winner was Menace. <laughs> no. Oh, Rip. Yeah, he spent his entire uh, <laughs> life savings. Yeah, you know. good stuff. Raccoon news. All right, a more fun follow for you than this stupid Raccoon Tycoon game. Have you seen the Raccoon Drive Through on? It's on all the platforms like TikTok, YouTube, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. This is a woman in British Columbia who she started noticing raccoons outside. So what do you mm-hmm. do? You feed them so they come back, yeah. of course. Because right. you want to see them again. Yeah, you want to have little buddies. And so what she does is she has a little sliding door or window, I should say, at her uh, kitchen. And every night when the raccoons are coming around, a little scritchy scritch, she feeds them hot dogs and cereal oh, and you know berries. Yeah. <laughs> so much raccoon <laughs> diarrhea all over the place. Oh, 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 oh there's raccoon, pe- poop. <laughs> raccoon poop. Poop. There's <laughs> raccoon, <laughs> raccoon poop. There's pizza. Oh, sweet. Wow. And they just keep coming every night, and then they bring their friends, and suddenly mm. you've got 300 cats in, or raccoons <laughs> in your yard. Yeah. Oh, she's like Mother Teresa. So you oh. search the raccoon drive through and you'll the see a bunch of videos of her feeding raccoons. Cock County. <laughs> <laughs> Wouldn't you love to feed a raccoon a hot dog? Yes. Uh, we had a raccoon show up at a family reunion we had when I was a little kid, and mm-hmm. it, was, it was begging for food because it was knew where we had, you know. Yeah. Food. And my, 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 everyone's like, get the hell away from that thing. It's going to yeah. bite you. It's got rabies. No. I mean, it would be scary, but if it was a friendly raccoon. Yeah, the raccoon knew you were holding. <laughs> Sheriff, <laughs> CJ Balls. That's right. <laughs> Another follow for you. Have you seen the raccoon saloon menace? I think I have. This is on YouTube. So what they did is they found an abandoned home and they knew they saw there were <laughs> raccoons in there. So they put up a live streaming camera. <laughs> oh yes. Okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And they have like a little slide mm-hmm. and some and like a little tire swing and some uh-huh. raccoon plushies. And it's a live stream throughout the day. The only problem is there's never any raccoons there. <laughs> it's Aww. like you, you scrub through and you see one raccoon and it's not like it's not playing on the swing or anything. It's just like sniffing around, eat oh, some food, leaves. Weak. Yeah, mega weak. But oh, if you well. want to check it out. Raccoon Saloon. There you go. Raccoon News. News. Raccoon News. Man, this is Raccoon News. We got some more Woody Show. Sheriff. CJ Balls. Coming up next. Hang on. (laughs) 